The Karlsruhe Institute of Technology, the KIT, is a fast area that is spread across multiple locations in Karlsruhe. The lectures and tutorials for students have been distributed over almost the entire area. Within the often tight schedule, students would have to find the time and most importantly, a place to study. This problem is well known by the student Kerstin. She has just come from her lecture and notes that she still has a bit of time until her next seminar. She decides to go to the library to get busy with her homework. Once there, she looks around for an empty seat. Unfortunately, she was not the only one who has come up with this idea because everything is already taken. Now Kerstin remembers her KIT Campus Guide app, which can be used to find a free working space. She opens the app and checks for available places. The place should have access to the wireless KIT network, perhaps a printer in the vicinity and also coffee machine would be nice. Kerstin actually found a space that is perfect and she wants to book it. She gives the date and time for her reservation. And the room is booked. For the moment it is just a provisional booking. It must be confirmed by Kerstin on her arrival. Now Kerstin walks to her room confident to have a free working room. There she is. In the office hangs a readable electronic room identification device. By scanning the label with her mobile phone, she confirms her reservation. Thus, it can be ensured that the space does not remain reserved if it is not used. Kerstin is a bit worried about the nasty question on her exercise sheet and she would like to see if her learning group has already discussed this. So she scans the QR code from the exercise sheet and the campus guide app directly brings her to the discussion group assigned to this exercise. There are no answers yet, so she posts her questions. In her learning group is also classmate Max. He receives Kerstin's posting while walking on the KIT campus. Max suggests to meet Kerstin in order to have a look at the exercise sheet together. The app knows Kerstin's current position and that the room has enough space for Max to join Kerstin. Kerstin extends the reservation. The kite the campus guide shows Max the quickest way into the room. The spontaneous emergency of our learning group can be supported by connecting the social networks such as Facebook or Google Plus with the information about places, spaces and other things. Max has found Kerstin and they are working together through the exercise sheet. Through the combination of social networks with real things, a new dimension in the evaluation of Kerstin's posting will be possible. In addition to the question on the exercise, is now also know that Kerstin and Max are currently working on this issue. In our example, this has brought a tutor of the study group to post a crucial type of Kerstin's question. In the example presented here, ideas were presented as the current internet of people with its social networks can be extended to the internet of things. In the European research project Open IoT and the KIT campus guide, solutions should be developed and tested showing how this might look like.